El Shafi El Sheikh sentenced to life in prison Friday in federal court in Alexandria, Virginia, for his role in the kidnapping and deaths of four Americans by Islamic State, including New Hampshire journalist James Foley and Kimball Union Academy graduate Stephen Sotloff. Too often when there's violence to our U.S. nationals in the world, there's no accountability. So this is a momentous day. James Foley's mother, Diane, says the verdict brings some justice. Let this sentencing make clear to all who dare to kidnap, torture, or kill any American citizen abroad that U.S. justice will find you wherever you are and that our government will hold you accountable for your crimes against our citizens. Diane Foley says more than 67 Americans are currently being detained abroad. So I urgently call on our President Biden to employ our shrewdest negotiation to quickly bring these innocent Americans home, lest they die in captivity as our sons and daughter did. Still, she says there has been progress, including a presidential executive order declaring this a national emergency and an extraordinary threat to our national security. El Sheikh's eight life sentences are to be served concurrently. There is no parole in the federal system. He plans to appeal his lawyer, saying his confessions should have been ruled inadmissible because of the alleged mistreatment while in custody. Reporting live, Grace Feinerman, WMUR News 9.